Welcome! This is Jay with Explorer Systems. We're going to take a look at printing thank you letters in batches in Versailles. If you've assigned thank you letters to gift records, either manually setting them or automatically through configuration of levels, letters will be automatically queued for printing when gifts are entered. You can run batches of letters as often as makes sense for your institution. Open the Development tab and click Thank You Letters. Before we run a batch, let's look at how to add a new template. Click Add, then New. Fill in code and description. From the drop-down, select a base template to copy from. Then enter a file name and click OK. You can now customize the template, which is covered in another video. It is also now available to be assigned in Level Setup. Once it is, any new GIFs entered at that level will print using that template. If you need to use the template for a GIF that was previously entered, open the Donor Manager, and in the Patrons record, open the specific GIFT record and change the assigned template. To run a batch, enter the date range of the letters you want to print. I previously ran letters through the end of March, so my start date this time will be April 1st, and I'll go through today. There are several filter and sort options you can use depending on your objective. Then click Retrieve Records. The bottom pane will display the records queued to print that satisfy your query parameters. You can scroll horizontally to see the information for each record that will merge into the letters, depending on the fields you use on the templates. If you use Address Block and Salutation, you can select your options from the lists. In the off chance that a record does not appear in the list that you expected to see, there are three things to check. First, all of your search parameters here in the batch card interface. And then in the gift record in Donor Manager, check that a template is indeed assigned and that the letter wasn't already printed. Now you can preview and print your letters. You can also print labels and envelopes for mailing the cards using this box. I recommend always previewing before printing for one final proofread. Once you are ready to print, you can print from within the preview mode. That way, in case you have problems with your printer, you can send the print job again before the letters are marked as printed. Once you exit preview mode, Versailles will ask if the letters should be marked as printed. If the printed pages look good, click OK. The letters will be removed from the queue. If you need to reprint, you can check Reprints Allowed. Be aware that any other GIFs within the date range that previously had been printed will be included in the list, so you may have more records than in the first batch that we just printed. If you need to reprint just one or a couple, you can isolate them using their GIFT numbers in the GIFT number filter. After you print the letters, they will be recorded in your mailing log as well as marked as printed in the individual GIFT details. For a copy of this information and step-by-step -step procedure, refer to the built-in user manual. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for when we upload additional videos. And remember, we're here to help. You can reach the Explorer Systems support team on the support forum of the Versailles website as well as via email and phone.